Hey there folks, this is Gwynny XI welcoming you right back to Let's Play Sonic Origins, this is episode 22. In the last episode, we made it to Sky Chase Zone. Sky Chase Zone, that's a hard thing to say. <laughs> so that's what we're going to be doing today. And I think it connects on to another zone as well. I think it does. Ooh, I did not see that coming. So they shoot downwards. Oh, I can use the D-pad instead of the analog stick for this. It's quite awkward because you'd, uh, you'd run along as well. So you don't go immediately left and right. You have to run to the edge and then you go left or right. Yeah, it's, it's a bit fiddly to be honest. We just run through. Oh, yeah, just run through. That worked. Wow, why am I having such issues? We stay back a little bit this time. It's like digging a shoot, well, no matter what you do. So, how do you stop it from happening, from hitting you? Because we can't shoot back. I'm pressing every button, and every button is jump. Aha! Gotcha! That'll totally shite. Okay. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay. Oh, maybe that's a shout. Ah, you can spin dash still. I didn't realise. Ha! Ah. Ooh. What happened there? Did I spin off the plane? This it doesn't say act one or two or anything like that this time either. It also doesn't say, here's a checkpoint for you. <laughs> so can we jump on top of it even though it's a propeller? There we go, that makes it a million times easier. I do not trust Tails though, to actually keep up. <laughs> I'm just going to end up falling off. Uh Turtles controlling turtles, that's quite fun. Ha. Nice. What? Oh, I need I need a ring. I need a ring. I was lucky, I was mashing X then. <laughs> oh, the little animals are just falling to the floor. They're gonna end up dying. And it's all Sonic's fault. Wait, man. However you look at it. <laughs> oh, this reminds me of again, the Game Gear one. Or the Master System one. They take a lot of ideas from them because, I don't know, I feel like the Master System one just doesn't get much praise or anything, even though it's incredible. Um, it could do with a bit of sprucing up a bit now, but even still, like just time-wise, like frame rate wise that sort of thing. Yeah, but I was talking about, when I say it by you, I don't mean the flying. I mean it's similar to the game in the big airshipy thing. Wing Fortress, here we go. It's similar in this sense. And it's hard. You can have game over, I think, if you go down with that. Yeah, I've always found this hard. Even the boss. Yeah, it's, it's not... Um, Nothing, something to enjoy. The track in this, though, it reminds me of Golden Axe. Anyone else? <laughs> it's just me. <laughs> what? I couldn't go right any further. And that platform wasn't coming left any further. That was... Yeah, okay, okay. You do you, game. I'm glad I haven't got lives. 
You can play the classic mode, by the way, in this version of the game. Just so you know, if you're wondering. The classic mode is still here. You still have letterboxed if you want a letterboxed. And uh, still have lives and all that. No coins. Harder version, I guess. Right, there we go. I jumped over a bit this time. Right, can you jump into the flames? I don't want to try. But I am curious. Hey! I doubt you can jump in the flames. After all this, I would like a checkpoint. I feel like it's been a while. Yes, definitely from the Master System one. Okay. I'm trying to take it a little bit slow. Ooh, look at these. Flippy things up in the air like this. I do not like this far into the level. Mm. Where have we ended up? Right back here! Wow. I see you up there. Here we are. Should be the flippy things. Yeah, here we go. Let's try it again. I've fallen so many times trying to do this. Yes! That was so easy and I, I just kept messing it up. Right, yeah, I'm not going for the speedy. Definitely not. Checkpoint. Yes! Definitely needed that. We're on the top now as well, so we should be near the end, right? Oh, not quite on the top. Okay. I see. Go up here. Kill the chicken. <laughs> oh, I love it. What the hell? Where are we going? <laughs> Bloody hell. Give loads. Oh, at least we had the bubble still on. Oh, that was tricky diamond. Bubble back on? Yeah. That's what I like. Hell, where am I meant to go? What's that about? Ah, there we go. I really don't want to fall now. Ah, okay, that worked out okay. I didn't expect it to, but it did. Okay, let's try it again from the top. Okay, keep jumping up until he's back out. There we go. Got it, I think. Oh, checkpoint! Oh, the fact that I lost that right at the checkpoint then was a bit annoying, but we got there now. We can't be far from the end now. Let me scratch my head. Here we go. Get rid of the nits, or feed the nits, as it were. <laughs> so keep them. Uh, yeah. ah, I, mean, <laughs> I never know where I'm going. It just flings me about. And when I'm this high, high up, I don't like that. Hey, Mel. What did I just... Ah, right. Okay. Here we go. Final boss time. What do we do? I see. We need to get on top of these and hit that when we can. There we go. We got three hits in. That wasn't too bad. And we could have got a fourth in. Really. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> At least I was still sort of using my invincibility frames to... Yeah. To get another hidden, that's what I was going to say. Is that it? We got the Chaos Emeralds, so we're going to get the good ending. Yeah, come on Tails, help us out. I feel like we didn't even fight Eggman. I can't jump or move. Ah, oh, there we go.
Can I do anything, Sonic? I can't do anything. I'm mashing buttons. Ah, okay. It's <laughs> Stick me up into space. Of course it is. We're not quite done yet. But I'm going to continue. Because I think this is just the boss. Yeah. Metal Sonic. Hello, you. We saw him back in CD. And now we're seeing him again. Whew. That scares me so much. Ah, just in time. I haven't got any rings. And I'd see that you can't have rings for this fight. Because we didn't see any on the way in. But maybe that'll be alright. I'm only willing to try for one... What the hell? Oh, Eggman, you twat. I'm only going to try for one hit every time he sort of does something. Is what I was going to say. You have plenty of time to see if he's going to jump or not during the spin. The thing is, you can't jump directly on top of him or you get hurt. Hey again, Mel. <laughs> he's got the, the rotatey things. The spiky rotatey things. Yeah. What's Eggman doing? You know he's going to do something. Div. What the hell? You just don't know when. I just don't know when it's coming. I'm going to try attacking now. Yeah, you can. You can get an easy first hit in. I see. Nice. I like having that first hit. How much health do you think he has? 10? As in 10 hits? Or... How many hit points? I think Eggman's going to do some at this time. <laughs> so I'll jump right into the spike. That's exactly what I meant to do. It's a hard. It's a hard one. I always thought so. Sonic 3 has a tough hard, a tough last boss as well. He's going to charge. We've only seen him do the charge once per per attempt at the fight so far. I wonder if he does it randomly or... Maybe. No, I think it's a definite attack pattern. Here we go. Eggman's going to do his thing. Ah, I see. So I think you have to... Go to the middle and duck. Not quite the middle, because a spike does come down in the dead centre. But to the left a bit. Yeah, well... I'll try and remember this time. Yeah, it's definitely a dead set attack pattern. He jumped that time and he jumped that time the last time as well. Right, this is the one. So if we go about by you and duck down. There we go. That worked. Ah, use the charge. Yeah, done. That's not too bad. It takes a bit of trial and error, that's all. Do we still have to fight them? Yeah, we do. This is the fight I was thinking of. When I said Sonic 3 has a hard last fight, this is the one I was thinking of. We haven't got any rings still. You have to just about get between the... <laughs> the spikes on his hands. We don't have to do Sonic again, do we? Oh, we do. The fact that it gives you no rings is insane to me. I'll see you there, back at... Eggman. 
Okay, here we go again. I've had a couple of goals now. I'm finding him hard. But I think I got... It's going to be slow. But I think I got a time that's perfect to hit him. You can risk it other times. Whenever you think the hands aren't going to hurt you. But if you just wait it out. It's going to take a long time, like I said. But we should be good. If we go for all the way to the right now. There we go. When it locks on, that's fine. And that's when you should hit him. Oh, God. <laughs> that's, that's not our way. Oh, we thought it would go. There we go. Now. There. Run away. He's got a lot of health as well. That's the thing. So if we take it this slow. Yeah. You really need him to land. Really far over to the right. So we don't crush him against the wall on the other side. <laughs> I shouldn't have risked it. Just a one hit every time. Greens. Okay, I've hit him twice. Just <laughs> so you know how far I've got. <laughs> and we should be fine at this rate. If I do it like that another seven times, he's got 16 health. I had a look just to see how how long this would take. Here we go. Get way out of the way for that. And I think it's going to be the exact same all the way through. I think. So there's nothing to worry about. And I'm not going to rush it at all now. Because we've seen how that works out. I love the backdrop for this boss. It's a very memorable boss. It's a very hard boss if you don't just follow the pattern. If trying to attack when he's moving his arms, so you just get that gap between the spikes. But I just can't do that consistently. I can do it now and again. But it doesn't always work out like like I'd like it to. So why bother? I'm in no rush. Sonic is, but I, I'm not. Okay, he's coming. He's a coming. See, we're nearly done now. It, even when you take it slow like this, the bosses in this game don't take long. I've heard the bosses in the new Sonic game take a while. Is it Superstars? Yeah, Superstars. I've heard they're quite slow bosses. I could go for an extra attack during those. I'm not going to now. We're close to the end, so I'm not going to risk that. It's just the fact that you've got uh, Metal Sonic as well. Before it. Like, when you lose on this fight, it, it makes it really gutting. Because Metal Sonic's easy once you've beat him. Once you've figured it out once or twice. But. It's just tedious, you know. It's just that extra amount of time used. To fight another boss again. And... Yes! Yes! Let's see the good ending. I think we've got cutscenes coming. Oh, <laughs> sort of. <laughs> After the credits, maybe. Oh, it's in black and white. Oh, a little flicky. Why does Tails look so angry, Billy? <laughs> or is he just serious because he's heard that uh, something bad's going down? Hey, Supersonic. Million birds. You 
can't control it. You can't go up and down and stuff. Hey. How did Eggman escape? I wonder. Credits time! <laughs> it's a pretty plain bit of credits, isn't it? It's just text. I know it's some yellow. Don't get me wrong, it's a very, very lovely yellow. But... <laughs> it's just a bit plain. Dull. Anyways, that is Sonic 2 all wrapped up. Like I said, we'll have cutscenes after the credits, so there's still a little bit more coming. But yeah, I'm glad that one's done, because that boss always gives me trouble. Like, I can never remember the pattern to kill him. It takes me having a few goes and then thinking, Oh yeah, you just run away when the spike hands are being shot to do, and then you just wait it out. You don't rush that boss. I know it's a final boss and you feel like you should be all action-y. But you don't need to. But yeah. This game. I've given my opinions throughout the series. But. It is one of my favourite Sonic games. 2 and 3 both are. 3 takes up another notch. and makes It, it adds some changes to the formula and stuff. But uh, this one. Some zones I love. Some zones I think. Not quite as strong. But. The music's really good. Even better in 3, but I've heard uh, 3 and Knuckles' music has changed for this version. Probably something to do with the Michael Jackson involvement and the legal issues and all that stuff. Dreams come true in 1992. They sure did for Sega. Not for the Dreamcast, but... <laughs> Milpo, Ippo, Oist, Nagi. Is there a thing where every sound assistant has to have a abbreviated or, you know, branded name? But yeah, I am really impressed with uh, the Origins package. Origins Plus, spe specifically. It's all really well put together. Loads of content. Even if you've got, if you've got Origins and not Plus, you can actually buy... The plus expansion to, you know, add all the Game Gear stuff and all that to it. For like eight, eight, nine pound, I think it was nine pound. Or, you know, eight ninety nine. Hey, they go, there goes the death egg. <laughs> What's that hiding in the bushes? What's that meant to be? Looks Rayman-ish. The eyes look Rayman-ish. I don't get what that's meant to be in the bush. Oh, so that's how Knuckles is portrayed as the uh, as the bad guy. Eggman convinces him to that Sonic and Tails are the bad guys. I see, I see, I see. Yeah, <laughs> actually starting Sonic Three now, and this is why Knuckles has them all. Angel Island Zone, and oh my God, I love Sonic Three. I think it is the best of the lot. Two, also like I said, two and three are all are both really good. I think three just about beats it in my opinion anyways that'll do for today this has been greeny xi hope you've enjoyed thank you so much for watching i'll see you again in a bit for sonic 3 in a bit folks Bye.